in Python. 2. Object oriented means directed towards objects. In other words, it means functionally directed towards modeling objects. Hello everyone, my name is Bowie Gon Gaonin and my student ID is 12421075. Today I'd like to present my final project for programming class. My project is about building your own audiobook as I demonstrated in the beginning of the video. So first of all, I would like to briefly explain my project description. Normally people would have to pay or subscribe for an audiobook which is not cost effective. With Python and some modules, you can create a program that reads out your PDF file and the only thing you need for this project is the PDF format of the book you want to read. There are, two, there are a total of two important modules we are using for this program. The first one is PYTTSX3 or Python Text-to-Speech ver version 3 and the second one is PYPDF2 or Python PDF2. The first one will basically make your text audible or like read it out loud and the second one will extract the text out of your PDF file. So this is the full code of this program. It contains only 12 lines of codes. So first of all, we begin with importing the two modules we have installed earlier using pip. And next, we have to open the book, which has to be in the same folder as this um, Python file. And here you can see that my PDF file is called OOPY, and we put .pdf here to let the program know that it is in the format of PDF. And we assign it to the book variable to open the file. Next, we call the module PYPDF2 and call the PDF file reader to read the book here, which is the OOPY PDF. In line 5, we will count the number of page by using PDF reader and call out the num pages here. Fun the, the function num pages will count the number of pages in our book. So in line 6, we will print the page number so we type print pages. On line 7, we're on to making the program read the text. So we have to, first of all, we have to initialize the PYTTXSX3 by using, by using a dot and INIT, which is initializing it. And in line 8, we will start with using the for loop and range function to set the page that we want it to be read. So in my program, I start from line 7 and until the end of the book. In the for loop, we will use the variable page to call the PDF file reader and its function get, get page to get the page that we want to read. In this case, I wrote only num, so we don't have to keep changing the page every time it changes. Then in line 10, we will extract the text out of the PDF file using the extract text function. And in the last two line, we will make the the program speak out the, the text out loud and run it by typing speaker say text and speaker run and read in the last line. When all of this is done, it should look like this. In Python, two. Object oriented means directed towards objects. In other words, it means functionally directed towards modeling objects. This is how simple you can make your own program for an audiobook with basic knowledge of programming in Python and it can save you a lot of money. So thank you for listening to my presentation.